Hi, my name is Eric Totero. I'm a senior analyst for Euromonitor International, where I lead the firm's automotive research practice. I'm excited to talk with you today about a few of the trends that we're noticing in our latest automotive data. Automotive sales grew by roughly 2.5% globally between 2016 and 2017. Within that top line figure, several emerging markets such as India grew by nearly 10% between 2016 and 2017. China, on the other hand, which has traditionally experienced significant growth year over year, grew at a comparably anemic 2.5% between 2016 and 2017 as that market matured and became more saturated. From a forecast perspective, we expect growth to be relatively slow going forward, especially in markets such as the United States, where a Trump-initiated trade war looms, but in Western Europe to pick up as diesel bans go into effect. In 2016 and 2017, we are seeing a 7% increase in the total pickup truck industry. We especially are seeing an increase in top brands such as Ford and Chevrolet as they are taking new innovative approaches to their newer models. We are seeing hybrid and all-electric vehicles such as the Ford F-150 hybrid, as well as the switch from steel-based to all-aluminum body trucks. As these top companies are still leading the market after making these changes, it is causing other brands to adopt the same techniques. From our 35 country analysis, we are seeing a forecasted increase of 1.5% in the total pickup truck industry. Sports car sales are declining as automakers prioritize investment in SUVs and pickup trucks. Total sports car sales are down 10% over the past year across our 35 country analysis. However, unlike sedans, which we expect to continue to decline, we expect sports cars to stabilize and even increase in the medium to long term. This growth is driven by a loyal customer base due to the lack of substitutes that exist for sports cars. Western Europe shows the largest market for growth with a particular preference for European sports car brands. German brands Mercedes-Benz, BMW, and Audi led the market in 2017 in the premium category. In the mainstream category, American brands Chevrolet, Ford, and Dodge led the way, cushioned by a high volume of sales from the United States. Japanese brands Infinity and Lexus are brands to watch, as Infinity's market share grew 183% over the past year with its continued efforts to update the Q60 model, and Lexus showed a strong position across all regional geographies. But despite all that we've talked about with unit sales, the biggest trends that we're following are actually not having to do with the physical features of the cars themselves, but rather moving away to things like connected, autonomous, shared and electric vehicles, things that deal a lot more with software than hardware.